So to be able to come out on top of all of that, you're going to have a pretty good understanding of the game. And it is like this game, there's a lot of execution that you have to do, but it really yeah. is like so much more like, you know, you got to know like your fundamentals, you got to know how to counterplay, you got to like be in a good mindset. Like you really can't get there while not playing the game too much, I think. And uh, yeah. so you end up with a lot of hidden bosses that way. Exactly. A lot of hidden bosses indeed. And I will say, despite one of our best players being Zenona, uh, he doesn't enter that much. He's one of those players that never really shows up. So... Yeah, just coming into this without the most Diddy Kong experience, right? We have a couple here and there, but it's not, it's not one of his most practiced matchups, that's for sure. And I'm expecting for this to get pretty aggressive. Yeah, likewise. likewise. Matt is going to be running in the entire game. Yeah. He, uh, uh, maybe. Sometimes he can throw out some fireballs and get to camping, but... That's the mix-up, you know? Yeah, pretty much. Every once in a while, he goes, oh, maybe I won't just run straight at you. Yeah, yeah. Matt likes to get in. He likes to put up the damage. It's going to be a lot of combos, a lot of extensions, uh, some some pretty technical Smash Bros. I'm excited for it. And Diddy Kong, the monkey flip is just such a good tool. Every time I see it, I'm like, wow, that, that move just is really good, huh? Yeah, it's going to be a great zone breaker in this uh, matchup, but it's going to be pretty easy for Mario to float back and catch it. Mario has a phenomenal air grip, it's a decent ground speed, so it's not always safe the extension on the platform. A lot of damage for Nat. I'm surprised to see us on a dual plat stage to start off. Eftel comes out in time to get that trade and, you know, set up the edge guard again potentially, but it doesn't get too much off of it. Yeah, I don't mind the. Ooh, the Nat and F smash not gonna get it done. But I do like the dual plat pick. We saw um, off of these. Upbeat takes yeah, the that was crazy. That was crazy. Interesting yeah. coverage. Both of these players and both these characters get a lot of extensions off of those two middle platforms, so I do like the pick here. Because um, they can both just get some crazy extensions. They do like to say Mario on PS2, and so maybe we don't take them there. But we can take them somewhere similar where we still like it. Yeah, you know? yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. And I like the idea there from Dan. Probably calling out the up and trying to cover it with the K. That would have just taken the stock out right, but he wasn't able to connect with it. See how much percent we gain stock get up here on this stock. But so far, it's looking like it's going to stay pretty even. Take it. Yeah, it was a well placed down there, but couldn't get the job done. Forcing a really awkward recovery, but can't take the stock about it. Has to chase with an up air and it doesn't. Banana connects, and here's a big percentage opportunity. Oh, up there. Up there. up there from the ground is gonna get okay. off and you see that. Up air out of shield, sure. Yeah. <laughs> if you want. If you insist. Where he puts on some solid damage there to up air. 82%. Nad can answer that back so quickly, though. Diddy Kong is always that kill percent in this matchup. Whoa, a nice water gun. Oh, we see a tough recovery. He runs off with the fair. Great coverage, but he's going to trade the stock. Just got to make it interesting. Got to make it 0 0 last stock. Got to make it an exciting episode. That's a good one. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nad turning around and playing to the crowd a little bit there. Yeah. Not sure who he was yelling at, but he was yelling at somebody. We've all got our boys cheering us on. Yeah. That's the beauty of it. I was just curious. I don't see Michigan behind. I don't know what he was yelling about. He just did that one for the fans of the, of the <laughs> <Yeah>. sport. <laughs> for the lovers of the game. He's trying to gain his fans uh, along the way, you know? Right, right, right. And I, I am loving how much he's trying to use Flood here to create the like so much awkwardness in the recovery. Yeah, that's the spot. I do expect uh, to see some pretty, pretty, pretty nasty offstage stocks in this matchup as Flood and Cape can both do some nasty things to get recovery choice. Mashes it out, gets a little greedy with his bubbles. Yeah, that's right. Gotta, gotta make sure your opponent knows that you're alive and you're willing to mash, you know? Yeah, pretty much. When I play the game, I won't mash. I'll let him. Yeah, right, bro. Right. <laughs> Only as long as you want. Yeah, okay, okay. It, it ain't worth it. <laughs> but here, we're getting serious. We're in the top cut of bracket, man. You gotta mash. Well over 100 You gotta mash! Well, players, that's why. Mash is out again. Is that from gonna do it? Not quite. Not quite. Not quite. 151%. Oh, no, down, down there down is definitely getting down it down. done. Great stuff from that. And you know, it's all because of the momentum of the suicide forward air. Couldn't have done it without it. You know what? Actually, yeah. Actually, true. <laughs> he was down by quite a bit, and he went out for that forward air. Tonight it stops. Really good stuff. Gave him some momentum, and he got the job done. If nothing else, that makes you feel a little good. And when you feel good, you play good. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. For the record, Wes up 2 1 on Icona on the main street, playing really well in a tough matchup. She came. I'm always a fan of uh, matchups that are 
it should be impossible to lose, but if you mess up once, you explode. Yeah, <laughs> that's so much of this game, though. Yeah. You just have to choose what what side of the coin you want. You either never get to interact, or <laughs> you explode if you do let them interact. Yeah, exactly. That's the ultimate formula. Now, River's trying to switch forward, or warrior, rather. It's not River's into Ori. Two Diddy Kongs in the runout. Big up air strings from that. That could have been the stalk if he got the extension, but River's is able to stay out of harm's way. Oh, and up bees, but hits nothing, gets punished from the landing on the platform. That just could have been way bigger. Yeah, kind of holding on for life now. Chasing with a couple more up airs. Really just not letting this monkey land. That grab was psychotic. Oh, and there's the flood usage. I love that. Yeah, we get it back here. I'm just looking to see Nad get some bigger punishes off of those floods. Yeah. We've seen a few times where he could have gotten a crazy extension. I did. I did want to be The idea of the neutral air rising uh, afterwards to try and cover the early up back to the ledge to try and knock him out of the barrels. Oh, good. But, you know, it, you know, you got to guess for that. It doesn't go for it. You know, but you don't get punished for going for it either. Yeah, it's gonna fall out of up smash again. Just living the fight another day. He's gonna keep scrapping as he does have the lead in the set. Looking to take an even bigger one. A couple of up airs on the platform. That was almost your stock. He extends with another up air. No jump. And that flood makes it real tough to get back. He almost catches him with another one. That would have been a stop for sure. Oh, the down air to cover the normal get up. It's interesting. Get back off stage. Nice left shot. Not able to connect with anything afterwards though. Mainstream West takes a close set over I er, Iconal. The crowd loving it. Game four, but 160% on his last stock in that game four. So. And that really is just keeping all this pressure up while being uh, not slowing down even a little. Yeah, the pressure has just been really strong. He's just running in the whole time, hasn't really opted to mix up the pace of play because I think he's just banking on overwhelming Rivers for uh, Worry right now. He's been able to super consistently push forward and just give him a hard time. He's going to go to the other side for the recovery, but that weak hit back air 185%. That goes for the banana off stage. Two down airs in a row, not going to connect. Gets the up smash for the punish, gets some space, pull the banana. But down air takes it and you catch a banana while you're there for your time. That's going to get it done. Man keeps trying to get these banana extensions, but Rory comes out on top of it yet again. Quite a bit of extra damage, 93%. We're really tossing the banana around. Everyone's getting their fair usage of it. Yes. Up the out of shield. I love, I love the little bit of charge you can get. Yeah. Really make sure. Yeah, charge on the S-Mash really makes sure that you can send the stock home. Nad's able to get a couple of up airs. Do we have the extension? Is that your stock? Up B, not quite going to do it off the yeah, top. Yeah, correctly. Good Rivers carry. Rivers able to put the banana back in hand. Back throw off stage. Nad putting on that stage pressure. It's been super strong. No jump. Not quite going to matter. Cape can't connect. Ooh, watch out. It's stuck in the corner now. The up wow, smash. Up smash. Gets it done. Something and you can a, just throw it out. Yeah, you really can. You really can. 2-0 lead now from that. It's so hard to punish even if you do whiff, and if it hits, you win. <laughs> you do you win the time. game. Right away. And Worry trying to get some composure here, taking some breaths, but also instantly bringing it back to small battle. Which is interesting. It's interesting. It hasn't worked out twice in a row. I don't mind it though. No, I, I, I'm always a fan of going back to the stage we lost on. You know, just saying, I just got to play better. Yeah. <laughs> just clean yeah. it up. It Don't worry stage, about anything else. I can play better. Don't worry about it. Just play better. Under the same under the same circumstances, you can still get it done. Because it's, it it's not been a blowout. It's been last dog. Yeah, they've all been close. It has just been that, uh, like, constricting, though. Lori hasn't really showed me anything that uh, can... Really strike fear into Nat, right? He hasn't no. done anything crazy, hasn't taken a big early stop. No, and Nat, that's been the difference. Nat, I think, is feeling it. I think he's playing up for the crowd. I think he's feeling hot. Yeah, yeah. He's throwing out forward airs. He's trading stocks. He's getting up smashes. Where he stops are all pretty bread and butter. We haven't really seen him make any, like, winning decisions yet. Who keeps the banana so you can catch it, I guess? So that's, that's, that's pretty that's cool. interesting idea. Yeah, I like that. But, you know, 
Diddy Kong catching the banana back. Pretty good item management. Pretty yeah. familiar with the banana, if I have to guess, seeing it in every time you play the game. See, now this is the percent where, despite technically the game being even, I, I do tend to feel like that it is more likely to take the stock early because he's been he's just been making the winning decisions more often. Rory hasn't oh, been letting oh, things rip. Spaghetti, it's spaghetti. And both people live somehow. Down to the up smash gets it done. Rory still can't find his kill. Good pressure from Nad, but a nice extension from Rory. That last in the down air. Rory wasn't ready for it. The flood off stage. Things get tougher and tougher for Rory. No connection off the down tilt, and Nad sends him across the stage with the back end. And it is starting to feel like uh, Nad is just kind of throwing stuff out. He's taking it a little bit easier, I dare say. He's just thinking, yeah, you know, it's been working. Like, why, you know, try anything crazy? And so it really is just going to be up to Worry to get this adaptation. Yeah, now at 160, Worry is tasked with finding a kill before Arrow's is going to get it done. Puts himself back in the game. And again, down but not out. The momentum has remained in Nad's favor, but it's never been that big. Worry at any given time could find some big extension or confirm and just swing the momentum very quickly. Monkey flipping it in doesn't get punished, even though it hits nothing. And these up airs is a scary spot to be. Oh, that was almost the stock if Nad could, could have gotten back to the platform. It was great DI uh, to be mindful to not go off stage. You get hit by the forward air, but yeah. then you, know, you get more up airs, you get more percent. Just have to switch up the DI again. Ooh, this could be big. Another offstage sequence. These are been solid for Nad. He is just going to down throw the banana. That has not been the formula for success for him. I was loving the flood usage earlier. I, I think I'm a big fan of that one. Yeah, Mario has so many other tools to take stocks off stage. You know I, didn't see, I didn't see when he lost his jump. Yeah, evidently Nad didn't either. <laughs> he, yeah, was, he was going way low like he was going to have a jump. But it looked like Worry knew. <laughs> he was the yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's this guy doing? Worry seen the know. This is back here is going to come through. Nad's off stage, and this is this is Worry's chance to really have a big momentum shifting moment. Nad, no, I, Nad has an unfortunate stock, loses it a little bit earlier than Worry expected. So now it's up to Worry to really capitalize on this and do something that's really going to make him feel confident. I think Worry's looking more confident for real right now. I agree. He's kind of throwing stuff around. He's feeling a little high, and it's working. Nad. Now he's got to learn how to keep up. It feels like the pace is a little bit faster out there. Yeah. Nad is kind of on the back foot more so than he has been. Worry's able to tack on this damage, slowly develop himself a bit of a lead. And Nad right now probably still kicking himself for that stock that he lost early. Not the way he wanted to lose it. And not really feeling like he got outplayed, feeling like he could still win this set. Now, oh, the ooh. banana saving our life. A betrayal at the ultimate level. And we get a star tail off the random up air. This random up air killing is yeah, bewildering to me. Yeah, I've been finding a lot of those. And whenever Mario gets to the Ooh, the double mana. That's 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 a tone setter. Yeah. That is yeah, yeah. that's that's exactly the type of the thing JP I was talking two? about. It's just 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 a nice sequence to get yourself an early stock. JV2, a big lead. Mad. Despite losing that early stock, definitely not the only reason he lost that game. He made a few other mistakes. He is now the one that is tasked with adapting. And we're seeing the music pick coming out. I'm interested to see what. If we're going for the Sonic series? I'm not so sure. <laughs> oh, I, I don't know if I agree. I don't know. I don't know what the music counter pick. Sub off the little buddy. Night of the Wind? I'm not even sure which one this is. But it's from Sonic, so I, I'm not so sure. Well, you like Sonic music? Uh, you know, I don't think it's the right vibe. I don't think it's the right vibe. I think you need warrior music, you know? Interesting. You gotta be ready to beat the crap out of somebody. Okay, I see it, I see it. And we are seeing an outfit switch coming out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we are going straight back to small. I was wondering if we'd see the stage change, but we don't. I like that. Keep it honest. Yeah, both these guys are very confident in their stage picks. Ooh, catches a banana with the back air and then gets the follow up off of it. Pretty even percent. And it really is starting to feel like where he's flying around the stage a lot more to me. I don't know. He, he's just looking faster to me. I agree. His movement's just been more solid. But overall, Nad still is the one that's kind of controlling the pace of him. And you know, that's sort of how Diddy Kong feels, you know? You're told sort of like. I can't let him pull banana, and then he has a banana, and you're like, well, he has a banana, and then, you know, you gotta play around that. But, you really gotta play around it so carefully. That was a great air dodge read for Murray to put 
attack on a lot of extra damage, and now 108% off stage. That was a great recovery to have. Very patient to avoid the banana boat. Rory's still in the driver's seat. Never mind. Great up smash from that. I, I think I already saw three up smashes coming out. Yeah, he threw out a lot. He was thinking, ah, he'll probably come out. And he does. We got the fireball minion going in for us. We're trying to get the approach. But now we're seeing 0-0. Zero, zero. Stock taken back with no extra change. That's great for Rory, keeping himself in this game. Banana on the ground does have that blue triangle above it and his nads. At least I'll be careful when he moves around it. And the item play has been great for both players so far. They've been tossing it back and forth, playing some hot potato with it. Uh, I think both of them are doing a great job with it. And, you know, it, it sort of comes down to what a lot of people like to say is you got to use Banana better than Diddy Kong in order to beat him. Yeah, true. And true. we'll just have to see if that's true. We'll just have to see how impactful it really is. It's hard. It's hard to do. Oh, catches the monkey flip. Goes out kind of deep, trying to get the cave. Oh, air to down air. Uh, air down air is certainly going to get it done as Rory has a bit of a crowd here cheering for him. Dad, Michigan did not show up for him. The back throw is going to send off stage though. Put himself in a good spot. F smash doesn't get it done. Nice side B. Rory still going to chase. I'm looking for these F smashes. Feeling a little greedy to try and even it back up and taking a lot of percent along the way for it. Yeah, these these nair down airs, these off stage interactions is, is ex exactly what I was talking about for Warrior. These big game winning decisions, just letting things rip, really getting your kill openings. And now Mad really needs to answer that. Banana. Mad looking out to get out kind of deep here, really wants the stock. Gets the grab in the back there, pulling banana again. Patience, Z drop there into a down smash. Great option to fill up that side. And now Matt has, has worked that out for him. This momentum really is feeling like the reverse 3 0 right now. Yeah, I'll say it really it. is. We're really going to have to see the mix up here. And we go to Hollow Bastion to try and change up the pace for without Nad. Interesting pick. Interesting pick. I got to imagine the bands were like Battlefield, PS2, and Smashville, maybe. Yeah, I mean, you can't let them go Battlefield. Yeah, for absolutely. Sure. You got to ban Battlefield, PS2. It's just whatever the third one is. The long flat, I don't know. I, I've seen Diddy Kong do some crazy stuff with Monkey Flip on these long flats before. So we'll have to see how it shapes up. But I know can sometimes get some combos that I stand all the way from left to right on this yeah. platform. You know, when you start in the bottom left and then go up to the middle right and then go up to the top left. So we'll see if Matt can get any of those going. I imagine that's the thought process behind this pick, but he lands on the banana, catches it. I think it's just going to come down to who can get the better punishes. You know, it's all advantage say it's feeling like. It feels like neutral wins are going back and forth, but the punishes are going, you know, got to get as much as you can. Yeah, games one and two, Nad was getting a lot off of every hit, and he was closing out kills pretty easily, and Rory just couldn't find kills consistently. But ever since then, Rory has really adapted, and he's found the big openings, he's found the big connections, and Nad's execution just hasn't been there. Goes for the Z-drop dare, and the banana hits, but the dare not quite in the right spot. Trying to get a ledge up here. He's, he's matching out the set has been amazing. That was a fast match. True. Oh, nice fireball placement from that. I was waiting for one of those to connect. Such a solid option. I was going for the trump there, but the timing a little off. But that left trump looked like it should have hit too. That I don't know. Nice. Just charging the up smash, expecting the empty landing. But Warriors? no. Warriors? 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 Rory's been doing a lot better not getting hit by those floods and those fireballs off stage. He was running into a lot of them in his first two games, but ever since then, he has not been getting hit by him in a banana and that's not actually going to get it done. And we'll just have to see how fast the answer back from that can be. Unless, you know, he's running out, but 5% up smash out of the ferry on the dash attack. And it's a hot set. Not much of a lead to speak up for Nat. He gets the banana back in hand. Rory picks it right back up though. Trading this banana back and forth, Mad. Good patience, but he can't get punished off of this monkey flip. The execution is not quite there. The options feeling a little bit more carefully placed here. Both players, I think, are feeling it. We're feeling a little nervous. Mad just can't find his combo openers. He can't find any of those big stock screening. Oh. He had all the oh, this flood could be huge. Oh. No big punish though. Great air dodge from him. It's almost so huge, but Matt couldn't get a lot out of it. Like, here's the Mario up here combo. 
Honestly, three up airs, you walk away without a happy man. You know, hey. That's true. That's, that's true. not so bad. Jazz not going to connect. A great side view there from Worry. Keeping himself in this game. Nad had a bit of momentum there. Could have run away with it. But Worry still fighting back. The falling down airs going to get falling out of. Both people really feel like they're just missing each other just barely. You've got to be placing these spacing so carefully. Definitely a lot of narrow misses. Bory had a really good idea with that empty hop of banana in hand. Couldn't find anything. The low recovery, a great option. Just the down air. Just have the double man already. You can only use the one usage. Yeah, I think he just opted for uh, the down air for damage. Wow, down to the four there, doesn't get a dime. Hits the dental again, but great DI to get out of that. Get off my stage. It's a great grab. Trying to get the back now is now. Banana down there gets it done. The crowd lights up. Poor worry. His people are coming out in space. Gets the parry. Gets the down air. Gets the wing grab. Big percent. Forward air. It doesn't spike, so it doesn't even count really. But, you know. <laughs> It's a great forward air for Nad to keep himself in a very even game at the end of this game five here. Stock's pretty even. Nad can answer back and even up percentages at any moment, but Worry is currently the one surging forward, giving Nad hell. Is back air and F-Tilt coming out some damage? Back air f is playing so much pressure here. But Worry really picking it up. Fireball. It could have been a grab. Back air there gets a grab. Off stage, great DI for Worry to keep himself alive, but now it's closer and closer to an even game. Oh, great parry. Gets the double down tilt into the grab. Go for the up air. Not. Air dodges were so scared. But we're terrified. Nad. He stays alive. The banana on deck. Pushing forward. Game five. The pressure sets in. The Nair goes in the right way for Nad. Oh. He lets the F smash rip. It doesn't connect. The, the up smash. smash doesn't get it done yet. Oh my goodness. And both players are last hit. The banana here is out. Any, anybody getting hit by the banana is dead, assuredly. Great patience. That Nair for Nad. Yeah. With the down throw into the F smash, gets oh. it done. Willie takes a hot set. They're going to hug it out. Good sportsmanship. Nad jumps up. Great set, though. Great set. Wow. And it really did go to last hit. The reverse 3 0.